Hey guys, this is Matt coming at you from Rustin Rob's Garage. <coughs> Excuse me. It's cold. Uh, just bringing you another finished creation from the Rod, Rustin Rod's Garage. Uh, this is my latest. Uh, it's the Honda S2000. Um, we'll go through this and show you a couple things I did different. Uh, first of all, uh, the nail polish paint color is called red carpet it's actually more of a burgundy and then when you sand it the red flakes are actually silver so you can see the silver flake in it but it still turned out pretty good uh, just went with the box wheels and tires they had some other ones that I didn't I didn't like them too much uh, I did decide to go with flat black for the hood and the, the roof I don't really care for it with the top on. Uh, I don't know if you can see in there. Uh, I couldn't find the shifter knob that came in the kit, which is okay because this is a uh, Parts by Parks bill of aluminum shifter knob, but just a nice little touch uh, with the kit. Uh, interior is just black on black, a uh, little gloss, a little semi gloss, a little flat. Uh, flocked the floor. Uh, where it gets interesting, uh, we'll show you in a minute. Uh, this is a 6.2 liter V8 uh, out of the 2010 Camaro, uh, which actually went in pretty well. I uh, did have to modify the drive shaft a bit. Uh, this is the kit rear exhaust from here back. The rest of it is made out of brass and just three thirty seconds uh, plastic uh, styrene tubing I bent uh, but it, you can see it fit real well um, it even fits real well you can't even see it under the car I don't know if you can see there but everything cleared uh, didn't have any issues with that We'll open the hood. I've got a hood prop, but we'll take it off for this. Uh, I decided I want to carbon fiber the hood. I uh, did that on another one. I just decided this time just do flat black, do something different. And here we have the LS motor. Uh, and this was a typical Tamiya kit. Uh, it's just a curbside. Uh, but this is the radiator out of a Corvette. Uh, I made the hose out of a piece of, of um, oh, 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 what is that stuff? Solder. Uh, and it's just flat black, silver, and aluminum paint uh, for the motor, which fits in there great uh, with the kit exhaust out of the, just the regular exhaust manifolds. Uh, there's plenty of room in this engine compartment. Uh, there's no air intake yet. Uh, I have to come up with something, either make something or find something that fits in there. Uh, the kit part doesn't really work very well. Uh, I wanted fairly clean fenders. Uh, didn't want to have any battery stuff, firewall stuff hanging out in there, so I did it clean. Uh, this car, the battery isn't under the hood to begin with. I believe it's in the back, back here. Uh, but that's where it's at now anyway uh, master cylinder all that stuff's hidden uh, between behind the clean firewall and the clean fenders which is just the uh, 10,000 styrene sheet that's glued to the inner frame and then just rolled and glued to the top of the fender so it fits nice and clean but that's the Honda uh, there'll be some slides coming up after it but the motor fits in there great uh, looks fabulous uh, just another off-the-wall build out of Rustin Rod's garage. Uh, and just an update on a, I had a paint job I wanted to try. Uh, Mr. Mini Dreams had a little how-to. I've tried this before and it didn't work. And it's kind of the lowrider style. And I just went with two colors. I didn't want to get crazy for the first time trying it. Uh, he had a, a great video on how to do it. If you follow it, uh, follow along real well. I don't think the stripes are, 
are straight. I think there's a little wobble in them. Uh, I don't know that you see it in the video, but it's there. Uh, just something I got to work with. And we decided to have fun with this. So we're going to call this banana. <laughs> so anybody knows what dominions are, we know we got to have our banana. In uh, a little side mural on the side. Just going to build a little low rider out of it. Nothing, nothing crazy. Just slam it down. Uh, I've got these uh, Pegasus spinners I'm going to put on there. For, for the wheels and tires. Uh, no motor. It's just going to be curbside. I have an idea for the interior. We'll see how that goes. But this is just a fun something to pass the time in between stuff. Just have fun with. But that's all that's going on uh, at the moment. Oh, I take that back. Uh, it's upside down, but we're working on the 29 Ford pickup. Uh, this one I am going to build factory, factory stock. Uh, replica stock, however you want to call it. Uh, the only thing I'm changing up on this is I'm actually going to put the wood in for the bed. Uh, other than that, it's going to have the wagon wheels and tires. Uh, so I say, we'll see what happens. Every time I say that, I end up changing something and getting crazy. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, that's all I got. Uh, everybody have a good Thanksgiving. Uh, enjoy your turkey. Don't watch too much football and uh, have a good good weekend. Mm -hmm.